You know what time it is? Uh, bedtime? <laughs> no, it's movie time. And I'm going to uh, fill this up with some popcorn and we're going to go check out a film. Uh, is it a good film? No. Is it Complete Pony? Likely. Uh, why are we doing it? Because we love to. Uh, you're already nauseous. I brought the bucket. Okay, well, don't fill it with too much popcorn. You might need to clear some space. Extra butter. Oh, one of these. How fun. Oh yes, my favorite type of film, surviving and bringing cash. Mm. Mm. It's a very popular subject these days. How to survive in Vancouver. Splendid nose shot. So what do you think he's saying? Um, right now, um, uh, I'm, I'm drawing a blank. Yeah, I totally understand that. Um, what do you think he's saying? I think he's saying um, uh, things about stuff. And my God, that's a big river thing called. I think I'll go this way near the food court. I have no idea. It's oh. like trying to find a Starbucks in Richmond. Maybe he thinks that if I only balance and scrape myself across this log the right way, I, I, no, no, no. I guess what he really should be saying, um, you know, because there seems to be no monologue, of course, is why am I here? Why was I born? Why am I in this film? Why did I crash my plane in the forest when the airstrip was right nearby? I have climbed flagpoles in my life, but I've never climbed a route. I'm trying to get to the root of this. And next, I'm a man cold. Because I hate being cold. I've ever told you I hate being cold. Sunny shine. And now, I still don't know. I still don't know what he's going on about. Well, he's supposed to be surviving. Uh, it's more like he's hiking, really, but he's he's not doing it the hard way because he's ignoring the trail and uh, just choosing all of the most awkward parts to... Hmm. It's more like he woke up, got dressed, put on his dress shoes and decided to do an obstacle course in a rainforest. It would seem. Uh, what he really needs is to be chased by Cylons right about now. That would work. Or perhaps a bear? So if this was you, what would you be thinking at this moment? Uh, I'd be thinking... Um, hmm. Yes, I'd be thinking hmm as well. <laughs> thinking, hmm, hmm, I hope I don't fall. And ah, uh, balls. I fell. It's like a deep meditation. It's balls deep. <laughs> Those are trees are totally emasculating and look at that. There's a pair of big rocks behind me. <laughs> that rock's got some stones, man. What is that, the Dutch angle? Mm. <laughs> what you don't know is that there's actually a 458 foot drop just below him. I didn't know that. Heights. Here's an idea. Uh, Try the bridge. Uh, Try a bridge. Oh, oh, oh Richard. Uh, um, <laughs> uh, it's okay. It's okay. I'll be Are okay. You sure? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. wait. Just, just don't, don't move it. Just in case. No, no, okay. I'm okay. He is now home. He found the craft services. Really good. Hope he brought cash. 
isn't busy at all. Sound by Thomas Edison's photograph. Well, Toasty. Well, it was fun in a not quite all that fun sort of way, but a beautiful scenery. Can't fault the scenery. The, the scenery was, without a doubt, a brilliant actor in this film. Well, there you go, and there you go, another great episode in the can. Why do we subject ourselves to these films? And just tell me that, why? Why do we do it, Richard? We do it for them, our audience. Those people who love us and who watch us and keep us uh, in celluloid tape. You hate us, don't you? You really hate us. <laughs> and speaking of you, hey, if you want to sponsor the show, we'd love it. Hit us up at sponsor us at uh, IndieAction.ca. Also, find us at IndieAction.ca and on Twitter at IndieActionTV. Yeah. Happy 2016, everyone. See you next time. is, uh, well, whatever passes in my stomach, is really not feeling that good. No, no, Richard, no, seriously, no, 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 no